Well, good morning, Fratcom. Guess what? It's day two of the seven day scent of the day challenge that we're going through. Today, I'm wearing Bond number nine, Brooklyn. It's 54 degrees out, feels like 48. We had a giant storm come through. Was this the right scent to wear today or not? Stay tuned and find out. Well, like I said, I am wearing Bond number nine, Brooklyn today. It never got out of the 50s, or it's not supposed to get out of the 50s today. And is this the right scent? Well, let me first tell you a little bit about it. Uh, Brooklyn was released in 2008 by perfumer Larisse Rami, Rami, something like that. I will put his name right here, bam. And uh, he's not only the perfumer, but he is also the president of Bond number nine, the company itself. So I thought that was pretty cool. First and foremost, I really think that Brooklyn is a unisex fragrance, period. That's it. Um, I also believe that it's a three season fragrance, which I think would be good in the spring and summer and fall, but most definitely, I think this is a summertime fragrance. I think that's where it's really gonna shine and it's really gonna do the best job. I also think that it's best for casual wear and you're gonna get moderate longevity and sillage from Brooklyn. It's not gonna be a monster. It did last about eight hours on my skin today and then it's faded off into almost nothing indistinguishable at this point. I know some people are gonna say they get 12 hours every single time that they wear it, um, but I got roughly about eight hours today. So the scent profile itself, it opens up really fresh, really crisp, right out of the gate, just pow, it jumps out at you like this is a super, super freshy. And then what it does is it turns into like a, a spicy woody uh, scent and I haven't heard anyone else say it but I got a distinct pepper note black pepper note coming off of my skin Brooklyn is actually classified as a woody spicy oriental the notes that you get from Brooklyn are cardamom geranium leaves cedar grapefruit juniper berries guyac wood and leather so do I think that Bond number nine, Brooklyn was the best choice I could have chose for today. I don't know. Absolutely not. I don't think that it was good enough or, or the right season, the right fragrance. I could have used a much darker, brighter, um, spicier scent. But I do believe that come this summer, that Bond number nine, Brooklyn, is going to be the perfect choice well not the perfect choice but a perfect choice for a fragrance for you so if you're looking for a new scent to explore this summer look no further than bond number nine brooklyn thanks y'all and we will catch you tomorrow and hopefully we'll get through day three because this does complete day two let's see what comes tomorrow So with day two complete, we're gonna be looking forward to tomorrow. I would like to one last time thank Matt over at Georgia Gent for sending me the box. <laughs>